We begin tonight with the terrifying scene that played out late today for commuters at a Greyhound bus station in Richmond, Virginia. A chaotic and deadly scene, an active shooter at the station shortly before 3 p.m. Tonight, we've learned officers with the Virginia State Police were reportedly there for some sort of exercise. They approached the man. Authorities say he then opened fire. Frightened passengers caught in the middle rushed away. One state trooper among several people who were shot and wounded in ABC's David Curley leads us off from the scene. Officers moving innocent bystanders away moments after the chaotic shooting. It was just before three. This man was like, get down, get down. Threw me to the ground. I was like, crawl, crawl. Virginia State Police reportedly in the midst of an exercise at that Richmond Greyhound bus station when a trooper encounters the suspect right inside the door. While he was talking to this individual, the individual pulled out a gun and shot the trooper. All units be advised, we have an active shooting. Two other troopers returned the gunman's fire passengers fleeing the terminal as ambulance crews arrive at the still chaotic scene. Greyhound terminal, multiple victims, this is going to be a mass casualty, working incident. The trooper who approached the gunman was shot at close range. Two civilians suffered gunshot wounds, said not to be life-threatening. The suspect was killed. The shooter is down, continue to secure. As the SWAT team stood down, Virginia police officials would not be specific about what kind of exercise the officers were conducting this afternoon at that bus station before the shooting. Police are still in the middle of the investigation here at the bus station. There is no indication this was anything more than a crime, no link to terrorism. But sad news we learned late today that the trooper shot has passed away. David?